Wiggle, bitch, and welcome back to Madden 17 Ultimate Team here today. Since yesterday, I ended up getting my ass beat for the first time in quite a while. I figured today, for the first video at least, I think I'm going to double upload Madden today, we're going to do a pack opening. They got these Ultimate Freeze Pack bundles. You're able to buy two of them. So I did eight come in a pack. So we have 16 ultimate freeze packs and each one also comes with a ghosts of Madden pack. And some of those ghosts of Madden players are absolutely fucking legit. And they go for like half a million coins, 600,000 coins. So it's very possible that we end up with something insane here today. Hopefully we do. If you guys want to see more pack opening videos, be sure to leave a like because this shit costs $150, motherfucker. God damn. All right, um, ultimate freeze pack, 16. I got plenty of room in my item binder. I got rid of everything. I think I told you guys that a long time ago, but here we go. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed, baby. We got frozen moments, tuck rule, Tom Brady. That ball looks a little, that ball's got a little too much air in it, doesn't it? Look at it. That ball's got a little too much air in it, I think. All right, there we go. 76, Corey Coleman, gold. Okay, another Tom Brady. Tuck rule. Ty Tyrod Taylor. Now, some of these gold players go for a lot, but I can also turn these gold players. Oh, hold up, hold up. We got an out of position Braxton Miller at QB here, even though didn't Braxton Miller used to play QB like in college or something? He was Ohio State, right? Braxton Miller. This guy, that card only goes for 3,000 coins? Fuck me, dude. I thought it was for more than that. It looks like one that you can put in a set for like a better card of him or something, but I guess not. Okay, they're playing in the snow, frozen moments, NFC, divisional playoff. Holy crap, they still do the visors. Okay, here we go. We got another out of position player. Who is it? TJ Clemmings, 82 overall, goes for 2,200 coins. All right, do we have any, no elites here. Jason Witten, 81 tight ends. Might be decent. That's fine though. I can put all those gold players and get gold badges out of it. Sell the gold badges for coins. It's not all bad, man. I'm telling you right now. Will Beatty, okay. Here we go. We got an 80. Tony Lippett. I'm not even going to look it up because those do not go for as many coins as I thought. But, oh uh, shit, I'll take 2,200. I got 38,000 coins right now. So, I definitely need to make at least one more change to my offense. Uh, I need to get a better right tackle to go. I need the fucking Dallas right tackle, but he's like 300,000 coins. So I'm not sure who I'm going to go after next. What about this big hoss? He's not going to be anything like Don Terry Poe, my out of position fullback, but he does 2,500 coins. Fuck that. Fuck that. If you guys see anything in the lineup, I'll show you guys the lineup after this. Bro, we're getting tons of out of position players. Each uh, each pack must come with like a guaranteed one or something. Another Braxton Miller right there. Hoping for some elites though. This was 20,000 points in total. It was 12,000 and then 8, or no, 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 no. Each one's 8,000. 16,000 points. I'm thinking that deserves at least one elite player. It was $150, goddammit. <laughs> I just bought the game again, twice, for this. Is that Tebow? Who's Joey Bosa? I don't even know. I'm about to just start speeding through this shit, man. I'm telling you. If they don't give me some elites, dude, what is going on? I know, okay, actually, you can take these frozen moments and put them, I'll show you guys afterwards. You probably already know if you watch the Madden videos, but we could take the frozen moments and put them into these things and unlock gifts. Or at least we could uh, before Christmas. And I actually unlocked like some pretty good players in the gifts once I once I got them. Oh my god. Okay, so we got a 93 kicker. Chris Boswell? Is that good? How does that compare to my actual kicker? Oh shit, that's all I got? Is Robert a That's my field goal kicker? No wonder I couldn't make 50 something yarders. What the fuck is that? Yeah, I'll take Chris Boswell. Actually, what does he go for? I thought I had a better kicker than that. I know I have a good punter. He goes for 27,000 coins. Hey, I'll fucking... Yeah, I'll take him. 93 overall. I'm not missing a single field goal. Are you kidding me? 
I didn't know I had an 81 kicker in there the entire time. Holy shit. I got a lot of gold players, though. I'm gonna sell all of the out of position golds by themselves and then put the rest into gold badges and turn them into elite badges, maybe. Oh, dude, come on. I mean, don't get me wrong. Elite kicker, that's great. That's great. It's definitely a needed part of the team. No joke. Okay, here we go. Geno Atkins, defensive tackle. My defense is set. Like, doesn't matter who I get on defense. They're not going to be better than what I already got. I'm telling you that right now. 86 overall. He goes for 14,000 coins. So it's not terrible. We got that big dude again. Uh, okay, Ty Montgomery at halfback out of position. I think I already have him at tight end, receiver. Some shit like that. Fuck with an elite. There it is. Derek Johnson at middle linebacker. Who the hell is it? <laughs> Derek Johnson, 85. Is that ultimate team base? He goes for 5,000 coins. So they give me an elite, but it's like the worst elite <laughs> you could have. And one that I don't need. A lot of these out of position golds, though. A lot of those. All right, here we go. We got a few more of these. Let's just speed through it. Okay, this is... Whoa, 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 hold up now. Three on the same page. Doug Baldwin out of position at QB? Come on. That fool is not. <laughs> They've even got a picture of him like throwing the football. Um, okay. Doug Baldwin, here we go. Out of position. This goes for only 14,000 coins, 88 overall. I got to sell him. I would sell my Steve McNair, but you can't can't sell steaming there i had calvin Pryor the third he was like my original cornerback he only goes for six thousand coins and then i got 86 russell wilson who i'm definitely not putting in the game this motherfucker will be throwing at the goal line not handing it off to marshawn lynch on some dumb shit his 86 card goes for six thousand coins so i mean i'm getting i'm gonna have quite a few coins like after i clear out all of these players I'll have over 100k. I'll have enough to get like a really good player. Let me know in the comments who you guys think is the next step. But wait until, okay, it's Derek Johnson again. A lot of shitty elites. <laughs> wait until I show you the team at the end of the, at the end of the video. Any more elites in here, baby? Let's go. Who is that? 87, Ben Roethlisberger. I might actually use him. I might actually use him. I know I got a 92. Oh shit, he has a 90 card. What does this go for? 8,300? Psych! I'm not using that motherfucker. I'm using Steve McNair, man. If you're gonna give me Roethlisberger, give me, like, give me his 90 card or something, right? Uh, more of the... Nothing but gold players in there. Josh... So many out-of-position players. It's gonna take me forever to sell all these, but I'm down. It's worth it. I might end up with, like, 150... 200,000 coins at the end of this. I know it doesn't look like it, but each player, man, when you go to clearing out your item binder, you really realize what each of these players is worth. 4,000 coins right there. This shit is gonna add up, man. 86 left end, David Irving. All right, so that was it. We got a lot of elite players, don't get me wrong. Just none of them were like high tier uh elite players but we got two ghosts of madden packs i don't know if these actually include like a ghost of madden player or what but we're about to find out it probably doesn't include a ghost of madden place pro what the fuck yes it does what? <laughs> leonard floyd right outside linebacker i need a right outside linebacker and he's got the pass rushing hold up man hold up I'm about to freak out. I just unplugged the device. Hold it. Let me move this back. I just freaked out for a second. I've been using Lorenzo Alexander at right outside linebacker because it's like all I had. But he's actually a left outside linebacker, so he's out of position and it cancels out his chemistry. Now if I have a real one, though, holy shit, he goes for 88,000 coins. Oh, and I could sell him if I want to. But he's also got the defensive chemistry. I can't even compare him because... God damn it. I can't compare him because um, technically Lorenzo Alexander is not uh, 
uh, right outside linebacker. He's left outside. But let me know in the comments what you guys think we should do. Do we go with Leonard Floyd and sell Lorenzo? Because if I sell Lorenzo, he goes for like 30,000 coins. If I sell Leonard, he goes for 88,000 coins. And I could use those coins to get a player that I really need. Do I really need a right outside linebacker? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Holy shit, can we get another player like that? Fuck me up and give me a 96 Deion Sanders. Is that a real card? Holy shit, no chance. No chance. Can I open up more of these? Ghosts of Madden packs? What the fuck? I should have opened up 16 of these. Is that a joke? I mean, okay, at defensive tackle, I kind of got the people I... I'm not going to lie, like... You compare him to my defensive tackles. I have uh, Darnell Dockett, who, you know, I guess he's just got a better power move, uh, play recognition. But the thing is, this Darnell Dockett has line pusher and pass rusher. Oh, but you know what? I guess if I, um, shit. Who's my other one? Uh, Darius, okay, block shedding, better. He does have a better power move and finesse move. But he's also got the line pusher and pass rush. Maybe I should sell this Darius? What does Sue go for, first of all? Let me see. 93 Ghosts of Madden, Nadamik and Sue. 116,000 coins. This Darius card that I bought goes for... What does it go for? 148,000 coins. And I think it's because the chemistry that he has. So Nadamik and Sue has the defensive um, chemistry. I don't know what IB is. Let's look at the lineup real quick before I do anything, do anything rash. And then y'all let me know in the comments what you think uh, I should do. I might listen to you. I don't. Know. <laughs> uh, okay. So on defense, say hypothetically, if I was to replace Nadamik and Sue with Darius, right? Let's go ahead and actually. Oh yeah, let's see let's see what this does here. Since we got the cards. If I was to take Floyd, put him in there, that gives us the pass rushing um thing or whatever. So the pass rushing chemistry is up there. 91. But if I take Darius out. Do I have five players with pass rush right now? I have five players with pass rush. So I should be able to take Darius out and put in Nadamik and Sue, but then I'm gonna lose my line pushing. Uh, line pushing fucking thing. I don't know, man. I'm kind of happy with my defense. I don't know. What do y'all think, man? Now I only got one line pusher, Darnell Dockett. But the pass rushing shit still works. Like, should I make this my lineup? This would be the new defense. I don't think it's going to make a huge deal, but my defense is great. Look at them. I could use a better corner, maybe. Should I go with this? Or should I stick with the same defense and sell both of those guys? I would end up with... Holy shit. If I sell Nadamik and Sue... Nah, you know what I'm about to do? Fuck it. I'm about to sell this Nadamik and Sue. I'm about to sell this Floyd. Whatever. Um, damn, actually, what does it do if I get five players with the Snowflake? If I get five Snowflake players on defense, what do I get? Plus one strength, plus one tackle, plus one play rigging. Eh, that ain't all that good. If I sell them, sell all the golds in there, I'm telling you, I will end up with over 300,000 coins, and I could buy the right tackle of the Cowboys, get rid of Schwartz here. I could get a better tight end, too. Oh, dude, I think I should sell them, man. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Keep them or sell them. If I, uh, if I use this lineup, I can still sell uh, Darius and who else would I be selling? Lorenzo Alexander, but I think I would get a few less coins because Lorenzo goes for like 30K, so do the math. Let me know in the comments what you guys think, and later today I'll probably be hopping into another game in this pro second string, pro first string league that we're in. And hopefully we don't get our ass beat. And I hope you guys enjoyed the pack opening video here today. If you did, be sure to leave a like if you didn't just refresh it and give it one more chance. And as always, guys, I don't really have an out.